Do you want to sit down and do it? I can sit down and do it? I think you should. Okay. It's only so much money you can take, right? Yeah. Okay, um, so in our lands, regards to range weapons, there's six different types of range weapons. Now, most of them have a long and a short range modifier, which means up to half range, the weapon is hitting on a three normally, and at long range, the weapons are hitting on fours, slightly harder to hit longer range. If someone was in cover, it's also slightly harder to hit by one. So the short range, hitting on threes, and in cover, now hitting on fours. Long range, and in cover, is now fives. The pistol is the only weapon that doesn't suffer from the long range modifier. So if you have a range 12 pistol, at short range, would be half the distance would be threes, and at long range, still threes. The only other weapon that is different to that is the sniper rifle, which works the opposite way around. It's easier to hit someone at long range with a weapon with a scope. So at long range, up to, let's say, 40 inches with your sniper rifle, it's threes. And in close range, if someone is two inches away from you, for example, less than half range, then it's fours to hit them. Okay, so I think we're going to demo a little bit of range combat here. So, and we're good. Okay, so in this demonstration, the green base model here has an assault rifle. So he has up to range 20, and he's had three successful action dice. And John has no reaction dice. Mm -hmm. ah. So he's going to declare which target to shoot at. So we have this unlucky fella here that's at short range. So remember, range 20 assault rifle, masses amounts of range. Definitely within half the range. So half the range of 20 is 10. So he's massively in. So he's going to attempt to shoot this model. So he is looking for threes because he's at short range. He's definitely out in the open, so he has no cover whatsoever. So we'll take a chance, and that's a that's a one. <laughs> that's an epic so commander. this is a demonstration of a free action. I can't do that. And so John now can move away from me up to three inches as a free dodge. So he's now back there. So that's wonderful. <clears throat> so now I'm going to take my chances at someone who's at. Oh yeah, that's right. More than 10 inches away. So that's long range, but out in the open. So he needs four, because it's slightly harder to hit them. And it's a six. six. So sixes are always good. So normally you would roll to hit, and if you hit the model, you would then roll for damage. But a six is a critical hit, which means that the red base model would lose a life and Ross would generate one loot dice so which he's putting in his pot when you <coughs> inflict a wound on a hostile model you generate loot dice the loot dice are calculated at the end of the game and this gives you a certain amount of credits to purchase new items and new abilities so he's now only got three uh, sorry two health points left when he's activated again, he will only be able to roll two dice. Okay. And you've got one dice left? I do have one dice left. Should we take our chances with this guy? So this guy is within short range, but he is in cover. So once again, threes normally will cover. Can you see his occupied space? I so if I get down low, I can see his occupied space. Now remember, it's the volume of the base. So his gun, all right, is sticking out. Doesn't so count. that doesn't count. So we say from right. there oh, onwards. It can. Yep. I can see a tiny little bit of it. So with the volume in the model, I can still see him. I'm looking for fours because he's in cover, but still short range. 
And it is an amazing <laughs> two. Who <laughs> rolls it behind? Which, once again, <laughs> is a miss. Is a miss. Now, um, that was that model's last action. And I can, if I wanted to, make a free action dodge. I don't think I will. I think I'll keep him there. Yeah. Yeah, that's not bad. 